Hey Pisces, welcome to Alexander Tarot. This is a bonus reading for someone who's conflicted about something at this very, very moment, okay? Something you have been going back and forth in your head about and you need clarity and you're like, I need to figure this shit out. So this is what we're gonna do. What I'm going to do is I'm gonna pull three cards for you to give you clarity. I'm going to pull what to say no to, the situation and what to say yes to. Okay, this is a direct message. It will not resonate with everyone, okay? If it resonates with you, the messages will be fluid, never force a reading, okay? However, perhaps you were led here by spirit because the messages are for you. So I'm gonna give this a shuffle, give you some clarity. I know how stressful it can be to go back and forth about shit in your head. Spirit, please show me the messages for Pisces, okay? Okay, what to say no to, the situation, what to say yes to, okay? What to say no to, you got a feeling you just can't shake. That little voice inside of you, listen to that shit. Okay, say no to anyone who's trying to manipulate you. If you feel like your person is playing you and you, the energy don't feel good and you just get this vibe in your gut, then do not let this person talk you out of your reality. Okay, say no to being manipulated. Okay, say no to somebody gaslighting you to question your own reality about what you feel and what you saw with your own eyes. Say no to that, okay? Remember your strength, remember who you are, remember that you are not insecure. Remember that you are not crazy and you are not paranoid, okay? Say no to somebody who has you thinking that you're crazy and you know that you're not. Say no to this person that tries to get you to think that your reality isn't real. Say no to that shit, remember, you know who you are. You are not insecure, okay? Say, say no to questioning that shit. The situation, take a fucking trip. Go see some shit. Do some new things. Talk to people cooler than you, okay? Get out. Get out of your head. Get out of your head and remove yourself. Remove yourself from the situation. I get a situation when you're with someone and you're so immersed in this that you're not even doing what you need to do to take care of yourself and put yourself first because you're constantly worried about what this person is saying to you. And you're like, what the fuck? Like, I feel crazy. Maybe I am bugging out. And I feel like that's the situation, but the reality is this person did something, put something in you, instilled something in you to question what you are seeing. And, your, and Spirit wants you to know that what you feel is real, okay? So perhaps if you remove yourself from this person, take a trip, take a walk, whatever you need to do, then you can get some time for yourself without this person getting in your head and trying to influence you with otherwise. It's manipulation, guys, okay? What to say yes to. You are going through some tough shit. Everyone has their turn. Welcome to yours. Gather your tired ass up and handle it. You have what it takes. Say yes to showing up for yourself, standing up for yourself with this person. After you get this break, retreat, come back and confront them in your strength. Confront them with what you, what you know is happening. This person is only playing you because you're allowing them to. So say yes to not allowing them to play you anymore. Say yes to saying, I am better than this bullshit, this breadcrumbing that you're giving me, this back and forth, this stress. Say yes to self-love, self-respect, and let this person go. You got this, sis. You got this, brother. Whoever this is listening, you got this. Say yes to you and say no to this motherfucker. Those are the messages that will love. Have a great one. Peace.